brand new office. It is basically the same space, but almost nothing from the old office is in here because almost everything is brand new, okay? And I'm really excited to show you guys everything I did with this space. I did this whole office revamp, renovation, you know, for my husband as a gift for Father's Day because he has been such an amazing father. I did something like this, something similar to this last year or last two years uh, where I did a makeover for him. So here I did an office makeover because this is his baby. Right now he calls here his sanctuary because he loves it so much. Unfortunately, I wasn't able to film his reaction to this office because of the way things happened. Some things were delayed. I ordered a lot of these things in January, but before some of them came to me, it came after Father's Day. Like, I don't even want to go into details, but anyway, so I wasn't even able to like film his reaction and all of that. But you guys will hear him talk later on. Um, he'll tell us about how he feels about this space. But yeah, like I'm really excited to be doing this for my husband. If you're a woman out there, if you're a wife out there and you have an amazing husband, okay? Caveat. If you have an amazing husband who is also an amazing father and all of that, then do something nice for him, okay? This is me encouraging you to do something really nice for your husband. It doesn't have to be something extra. It can just be rearranging what he already has. You don't even have to buy new things. It can be rearranging or redecorating what he already has. It can be buying new things. It can be whatever, but just do something special for the man in your life today to tell him thank you for you know basically existing and doing well <laughs> okay so let me give you guys a rundown of all the things that i did in this space so the first thing i did was to paint okay so this place when we were painting the house actually my husband is one that actually painted this office himself i just told him why don't you just paint this wall black even though I've always had it in my mind that whenever I paint here, I'm going to paint this wall black and the rest of the office white. So when we were painting and he was painting his office, I was like, just paint this wall black now. Yeah, it'd be nice if I paint it black. Okay, so after this wall was painted, I went ahead to change the furniture. So now, the furniture that used to be here was one, you guys will see it, okay? I didn't really like that furniture. I was just managing it for the longest time. So yeah, I now contacted Yuli Interiors to make this office furniture for him. Okay, that's the desk and the storage units behind me now this desk is actually two storage units and then the top on it so it's not like screwed together so she made the top in such a way that you can just you know place it on top of the two storage units and it just stays okay like now it is very strong it's not going anywhere like it's not going anywhere this is actually very very solid furniture I'm really really impressed with this one like Good job and she got my dream she got my vision and one thing i like about all the storage units now is that even though this is a very small space this is actually a very 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 like if i do like this <laughs> if i do like this my hand is literally touching can touch from side to side like this right so it's actually a small space and now he has lots of storage after we moved his things into here so many empty spaces though, so many empty drawers here and I'm happy about it because it means that he can now put things in a well-organized way, okay? Anyway, moving on. So, on top of this desk, we have this, um, I don't know what to call it, but it's basically for lifting the monitor so that you can put things on there and you can put multiple monitors on it. I got it from Amazon. I'm going to leave a link to everything I bought in the description box, okay? And I also got this monitor light from Amazon as well, okay? And you know, the whole setup looks very very cool okay very very cool then i got this potted plant here i tried to incorporate a lot of greens as well because yeah so many black and whites like <laughs> so many black not that black and white black and browns okay in this office so many black and brown so i had to incorporate you know green and just i'll get to these paintings later but anyway i had to incorporate some things here to add some life to it okay i got the potted plants these small pot plants i got them from ikea then this flower here, I got it from D-Line, okay? And now, these floating shelves here, I also got them from Ikea. I tried to get the ones that are similar color as the wood I chose for his tabletop. And we just put them here, just basically to like, you know, frame the whole table setup and all of that. On top of the ones with his left, he has his picture with the kids. I love these pictures a lot. They have this Burj Khalifa. Um, this thing I got it in Dubai when I traveled to Dubai. Also, this potted plant here with dry leaves 
that have you know a scent then right here beside it i have this standing lamp i also got it from d line i wanted to have extra lighting here this place actually is a dark place okay this office is quite dark we have one light up here but it doesn't illuminate this place so well because of the black wall which i actually wanted okay it's the kind of vibe i was going for i wanted a dark not gloomy but just dark and you know cool cool space Man space is not everything doesn't have to be bright and airy for it to be nice. Okay, now on top of here I have this vintage um, Car I love this so much. I was supposed to buy a vintage bike But I was wasting time and I never got back there. I didn't see the bike again So I bought this vintage car then also this person that is reading I got this from Shane then over here another picture. This is of the whole family me him and the kids you know, the most important things in his life ever, ever, ever. Okay. <laughs> then here we have a plaque. I just turned it to the back because if you guys see the what is written on it, you would know some personal things about him. But yeah, this plaque here, it means a lot to him. And that's why I left it here for him, just to remind him that, you know, you don't try, you don't try. Okay. <laughs> okay. And then here we have this bookshelf. Um, he has his books in here. Some of my books are here as well. In fact, a lot of them are my books. But you know, some of them are books that he's reading now. He's currently into reading books, so you know that's why I, you know, put this bookshelf for him. So any book he reads or buys, he keeps them there. And then this person here looks like someone thinking this was supposed to be on this place while this book was supposed to be up here, which is still doable actually. It's still doable. Hmm. It's still doable, but I prefer this color here. Anyway. Um, yeah, I actually got this from Shein as well. Okay, then here we have our old printer, our vintage printer. Okay, it's vintage. Aha, uh -huh. so these two paintings here, let me give you guys just about this painting. So this one was very intentional. I wanted my kids' handprints. Okay, so these are their handprints. So this is Cora, Ava, and Sophia's handprint. So I just framed this here. I got the frames from IKEA as well. So I just framed their handprints you know in nice bright colors and you know i liked it so i gave it i put it for him there then i also made a different painting let me see that painting here so this was supposed to be the second painting just a simple sunset painting nothing serious but you know just nice but the mistake i made was i taped the perimeter so when i now finally removed the tape the painting was too small for this inside frame so it just didn't work there i now removed it Tell me why Oga saw this other painting I did. This other painting I did was even just random. I had extra paint. I wanted to just, I didn't want me to wash the paint off. I said, let me just paint anything random, abstract. I was just, in fact, I didn't even plan it. I was just doing brushes anyhow, just so that, you know, I don't waste the paint. And when he saw it, he was like, he loves it. He loves it. He wants it in his office. I was like, no, don't worry. I want to redo this painting. I'm still going to redo it, yeah. Don't worry, I'm going to redo this sunset painting. You know, I like it. I'm going to redo it for you. He was like, nope, I should leave this one for him. I said, oh, God, this thing is children painting. It looks like children painting. It doesn't look serious. It doesn't look professional or anything like that. He was like, he loves it and he wants it. So that is why this painting is here. It's not my office, so I cannot complain. But it just adds some pop of color to the office. And, you know, my kids love it as well. So make it day there. <laughs> so I also got some storage organizers for him. They are inside the drawers, but we have more on the way. I also have his mouse pad coming. He has a small one, but I bought a bigger one that you can just place things on. That's really nice. So that one is coming as well. But yeah, um, this is office chair. I think this is the only thing that existed in the previous office. Maybe this and the um, what is the name and the printer. I bought a new AC for him. Um, this is my old monitor that he bought it for me on my birthday like two years ago and i haven't really been using it so much and his own monitor was going bad so he just i just told him to just take my own i'll buy a proper proper um, desktop not monitor this time i'll buy a desktop so that is why i gave him my monitor okay the blinds the blinds were here before black blinds basic they were here before what else what else what else okay he has this small speaker here i try to give him the speaker as well then last but not the least is this um, bench here this bench was actually for my decor right so i have it as my part of my decor piece somewhere else i'll show you guys in a different video if you are following me on instagram you'd have already seen it there so i have it there right but anytime my kids come to the office and want to you know watch something with him or spend time with him or talk with him then they sit on this bench me as well anytime i come here which is not that often 
I can sit here, but I already sit here. I just stand at the door, talk with him, talk with him, and then walk out and go. But yeah, that's it basically for his office. I love this space. I love what I was able to do with this space. Um, this wall is just blank white wall, and I did it on purpose, okay, just to make here look a little bit bigger than it actually is, okay. It's so funny. You see my husband's drawer here. He has. I one day I was just checking for something. I now saw children pencils, eraser you know all those sharpness and stuff like that so them in here so apparently he did not want anytime he wants to do assignments with the kids or wants to do anything with the kids he will have to go and start looking for their own so he has to go and buy his own set of everything and he has it here crayons and all so whatever it is they want to do in this office he can just take from there and you know they're good to go um for the floors the floors are still the regular tiles that were here before i was thinking of putting a rug for him before but i thought against it like it will make here quite hot if the AC is not on but yeah that's it for this space I really really enjoyed doing this for him it makes me happy that it makes him happy and let me tell you guys okay there has been a shift in his mood since he got this office I don't know if he knows that but me I know that there has been a shift in his mood it's not like he was moody before but he's now more happier and, ex and more expressive than before and I'm like Money is good though. <laughs> and it's not even about you know having money to do these things. It's about the thoughts, okay? Having the money but being able to conceptualize something that can improve your partner's life and then doing it, okay? So again, like I said, it's not about oh, I don't have money to go and buy new monitor or new AC or new this and that. It's about what can you do to improve his life. I saw a need which was you know a space for him that he can enjoy himself in when he's working from home, when he's just chilling and relaxing. And I, you know, I did something about it. Okay, so look for a need that your husband has and do something about it. If you're a husband watching this, yes. But anyway, if you're a husband watching this, you're welcome. Okay. And I need a cut. Whatever they do for you, I need a cut for me. But anyway, yeah. So baby, come and talk to us. Come and tell us what you feel, how you feel about your office. How do you feel about your office? Yeah, I think the expression. <laughs> Says it all now. Mm -hmm. um, you've shown them the before. Yes. <laughs> good, 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 good. So this is now my, now my, new, my new kingdom. Your new kingdom? Yes. Your, what do you even call it? Like sanctuary? Yes. See, this man, let me tell you what man did to me sanctuary. one day. I was here talking to him. He was just doing face one kind. I said, What is it? And I said, I should do it. I should close his door or something like that. Can you remember? Yes, now you are disturbing the. The, the atmosphere, yeah, the, the, you know, the serene atmosphere here. I mean, you know, they cannot see you because you're calm, probably. Yeah. <laughs> uh, so, me, Amy, Amy, disturb the serene. Yes, Amy. Anyway, so that's it, guys. Thank you so much for watching. Were you surprised? Yes, for, uh, the, for the furniture. Yes, for the furniture. Mm -hmm. Right? Yes, that is. Um, yeah, it came in bits now, so mm -hmm. I, I actually painted here. Mm -hmm. So, still, ah, the painting here, black, how will it look? How will it look? Mm -hmm. Until the furniture now came and just blended with everything. Wonderful. <laughs> <laughs> I'm too much, I'm too much. No, I mean, it's, um, it's quite thoughtful. Yeah. I mean, yes, yes, yes. So, I'll show them my lights now. But they're not common. No, it's common. I need to put this one on. Oh! It's powered from here. Oh! I'm teaching you. Okay. So, so you can put it on. Uh -huh.